Happy people are also less hostile. Uh, this point was brought home to me a few years ago. I was driving to the local McDonald's. My kids were in the back seat. I stopped at a red light. The light turned green. I proceeded to make a legal turn to go into the McDonald's drive through line. When all of a sudden, a car in the opposite lane of traffic ran their red light and careened towards me at a very high rate of speed. So I swerved and braked to one side, and they swerved to the other side, and we didn't collide, but it was very narrowly a really serious collision. So I catch my breath, proceed to drive into the drive through line, and guess who's now in front of me in the line? That car, yeah. So they place their order, they go to the window to get their food, and they then proceed to have like a 20-minute conversation with the cashier, like it's their long-lost cousin or something. And I'm getting more and more irritated. You nearly killed me. Now it's a 20-minute drive-through experience. <laughs> Finally, they pull away. And as they pull away, they roll their window down. They stick their hand out. And they do a little wave like this towards my car. So I rolled down my window. <laughs> and I made a different gesture. I drive to the window. I hand my credit card in. And the cashier goes, oh, no, that car just paid for your food. So then I felt like that because um, they'd already driven away and my kids had seen the gesture and, and clearly they were like, listen, you know, we nearly killed you, but your egg McMuffin is free, so we're, we're good, right? right? But of course, in that moment, my hostility faded, my anger faded, and I'm going to talk later today about how even small moments can reduce feelings of anger and increase happiness. Thank you.